and to come to a conclusion whether the existing data is also current, relevant, reliable, and particularly also accessible, because there might be data there, but it might be very, very difficult to access. And what's, of course, highly troubling from a, for, for the biopharmaceutical industry from a business planning perspective is that we've got relatively unpredictable outcomes. So between different jurisdictions, we submit the same or virtually identical dossiers and have very different delays and have very different outcomes. targeting and we can demonstrate that we're targeting this unmet need for example again with patient experience data and a more rare disease that is not well understood with natural history data with burden of disease data that will definitely improve our position with the hda bodies for example if we have an oral product as opposed to the IV current standard of care. It is important that we don't just assume, of course, patients will like that more. It is that we clearly demonstrate patient preference data for the benefits and what the exact benefits are of the different route of administration.